That's right. We spoke with a local couple aboard that plane, and they say within minutes of taking off from Beijing's airport, they heard a loud crashing sound coming from outside, and they say within uh, minutes, only at, and only after the plane landed, they learned that flames were shooting out of the engine. And about five minutes into the flight, we heard a loud noise. I thought the plane seemed to have a eerie sound. Dennis and Linda Predholm are reliving the moments after taking off on Delta Flight 188 from Beijing, China, to Detroit Metro Airport yesterday morning. And I mentioned it to him uh, that it didn't sound normal. Within minutes, the couple noticed something was very wrong. I noticed that we weren't climbing anymore. After several minutes of not knowing what was happening, the pilot made an announcement to passengers. The pilot finally came on and said there was a compressor issue and we were turning around and going back to Beijing. 7 Action News has obtained video footage of Delta Flight 188 in the air shortly after takeoff. And flames can be seen shooting out of one of the engines. So that was a scary thing to know. After roughly 45 minutes circling Beijing's airport, the frightening ordeal ended safely. And finally we were able to deplane and they canceled the flight. The Predhomes say the ordeal was scary to say the least. But the worst part, they say, the delay caused them to miss a very important moment here at home. Our granddaughter's graduation from University of Michigan, which was on Saturday morning about 10 o'clock, so we were sorry that happened, but at least we're home safe and sound. Back here live, a scary situation indeed, but again, this couple is thankful to be back home safely tonight. Live from Detroit Metro Airport, Gino VG, 7 Action News. We're thankful for him. Gino, thank you.